Hello guys, in this video, we're going to talk about how is GA4 better than Google Universal Analytics? Before we begin, please hit that like button to show us your support and help our videos reach more people. Now let's get started. Google Analytics 4 uses different data structures and collection logic. With Universal Analytics, the metric that stands out is the page views, while Google Analytics 4 focuses on events. You won't get generalized insights about your audiences, but you can understand how people interact with your site and your app. Users GA4 uses three user metrics, such as total users, active users, and new users. In Universal Analytics, it only has total and new users. It is better to focus on active users rather than the total users who might have inactive users as well. Next, page views. When gathering data using page views, GA4 combines both web and app data in the same property, while Universal Analytics tracks views in separate mobile-specific properties. Next, sessions. UA session, the user is actively engaged with your site or app, while GA4 session is considered when a session starts. UA allows a session to be started when midnight arrives, but GA4 sessions are not restarted at midnight. Next, session or traffic-based acquisition metrics. GA4's acquisition metrics are aligned with the metrics of users or sessions. Next, conversions. When submitting forms, UA's conversion counts a single user who submits multiple forms as one conversion only while GA4 counts a single user who submits the form two times will count it as two separate conversions. Next, bounce rate. Universal Analytics counts the percentage of single-page sessions with no interaction with the page as a bounce rate. GA4 has a percentage of sessions where the user only visits your site and leaves without triggering events. It will count as a bounce. Also, GA4 counts the session as a bounce when a user doesn't meet any criteria for an engaged session. Bounce rate in GA4 provides a useful way of measuring the rate that your customers engage with your app or your site. Next, event count. UA has separate metrics such as category, action, and label. The total events increments every time each of these events are triggered. GA4 events have no category, action, or label events. Every action, such as when someone views your page, is considered an event count. GA4's events-based model will target each user interaction as individual events. GA4 suggests new audiences. You can view this data under Library, then go to Audiences. You can also customize report navigation. It is possible to edit all reporting objects in a property, including collections, detail, and overview reports. You can create a new collection to change how reports appear in the report navigation. Google Analytics has new metrics that you can use. It has engaged time, engaged sessions, and engaged rate. Google Analytics 4 has predictive metrics that can help you make decisions based on user behaviors. You can look at the purchase probability, churn probability, and predicted revenue. These metrics help you predict the future behavior of users. The Explore tab on GA4 provides more control over how you want your data to be shown visually. It's an improvement from the data visualization from Universal Analytics. Next, Segment Overlap. Segments can be used in both Universal Analytics and Google Analytics 4. Segments can be a condition group, such as users who came from a specific location, users who visited your page, or users who purchased your products. Next, Funnel Exploration. You can find out how your visitors become customers as they purchase one time or as they become repeat customers. Path exploration. Path analysis visualizes event streams such as the tree graph. Event streams are a series of events that are triggered by a user's actions. This can help marketers learn which repeating behavior is not beneficial for their strategies. ga force flexibility with data analysis is much better than the universal analytics. It can better predict user behavior, which can lead to better analysis and marketing decisions. 
We have a marketing app that allows you to track ads from your competitors. Adplify gives you seven popular SaaS tools for total Facebook ads domination. With Page Ad Watcher, you can track ads from your competitors. With Hidden Insights and Audiences Finder, you can find high-profit audiences that Facebook Ad Manager hides from you. Boost your conversions with behavioral retargeting. With Page Targeter, you can get the audiences and the strategies of top businesses in your niche. With Email List to Audience, you can turn every lead into a buyer with Instant List to Facebook retargeting. With Ad Decorator, you can make people stop scrolling every time they see your ad. With ROI Calculator, scale your ad's profitability without paying first. Try Adplify now. Go to getadplify.in. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.